Yo, what is up guys? It's Retro Giraffe and welcome back to my channel. And if you haven't seen the previous videos already, I've got a bunch of Sword and Shield products. I have a few Elite Trainer boxes and I have a booster box ready to open for you guys. If you haven't seen my previous video of opening the Zamazenta Elite Trainer box, please go check it out. And for today's video, we'll be opening the counterpart, which is the Zacian Elite Trainer box. And obviously from the color scheme, you can see that it's uh, primarily blue. So without further ado, let's open it up and see what we can get. Alright, so let's just get right into it. So for this video, we'll be actually going through the Zamazenta box. And as mentioned before, the Pokemon company actually started printing the Pokemon logo on the shrink wrap of the Elite Trainer boxes. Because usually they didn't do that, they just had it in a clear plastic wrap. But um, I like the direction they're going in. Personally, I like the little logo on the shrink wrap. But yeah, so enough with the shrink wrap, let's actually just open it up and see what we get inside. And let's just slide the plastic right off. And if you've seen the previous video for the Zacian box, you will know it's pretty similar. But I'm um, just taking this out. Let's first take a look at the little, uh, I guess, the outer shell. So obviously, the theme of this box is more blue. But if you guys want to pause and read the back of this, you guys are more than welcome to. But this is all the contents that you'll be receiving. And as always, for all Lee Trainer boxes, this little outer shell comes with the different artworks for the booster boxes. So we have Zacian, Zamazenta, Lapras G-Max, and a Snorlax V-Max. Or G-Max, sorry. So we have that. And we also have the reading material, which is basically just a picture book, but shows you all the cards within the set. Let me just briefly just skim through this. We have the different V cards right there. Um, also some synergies um, within the set. And we have all the cards right here, starting from grass, you know, water. Cool, oh, skip through. And the big chase cards start from this page. So we have the full arts down here, moving on to this page. Marnie definitely wants to get that. Best girl skipped a whole page. Um, we have Professor Magnolia, Team Yelgrunt, and the Rainbow Rares. Again, definitely want to pull that Marnie, or even the Professor. And as mentioned before, this set comes with six gold cards. So we have two of which are the box legendaries, so Zacian and Zamazenta V. And we also have these four trainers right here. We have a Air Balloon, Metal Saucer, Ordinary Rod, and a Quick Ball. So that's it for the booklet. And let's just get into the box, but um, I love the new design for these new uh, Elite Trainer boxes. I definitely think this will make the value of, I guess, older Elite Trainer boxes, or not older, but I guess this will definitely increase the value of, I guess, the newer Elite Trainer boxes because of the quality of these boxes. I mean, just look at it. There's like a gold trim around Zash or Zamazenta. There's like a blue pinstripe, if you guys can see that. Pokemon Sword and Shield is like embossed in gold. Like they're really going hard and like the little like angle design. Gotta love it. Let's take this insert out and even like the insert it's gold. Like I think usually it's just white or black but Pokemon Company's really trying. And we'll get into the packs at the very end but Gotta start off with what comes in it. So we have the poison and burn markers. Nothing crazy there. I love these new dice. So um, because this is the Zamazenta box, um, this does come with like a clear red glitter um, dice. Let me show you it from this side. So the text doesn't get in the way. But as you can see, it's a clear red glitter dice. And the damage counters are in blue. And they actually have the numbers compared to like just like the dots on the dice to keep better track of like the damage that your Pokemon currently have. Definitely think this is a cool touch. And we have the deck dividers and because this one is a Zamzenta one, 
This one is red with the blue pinstripes with the gold border around it. And on the back we have the red and the gold. Very nice. The Super Saiyan Energies, gotta love it. And the card sleeves as well. Blue pinstripes, red Zamazenta, gold border around it, silver inside, classic Pokemon. And again, we have eight packs. Also, for this one, we actually get two of each, which works out perfectly. So let's just go from left to right, starting with the first pack, which is a Zacian pack. So we got a Mencino, a Sobble, best starter, in my opinion, for this generation, Blipbug, Baltoy, Wooloo, a Galarian Lanoon, Energy Switch, a Bisharp, a Reverse Inteleon, very nice. And I gotta love that uh, reverse pattern. And we are starting off with a Cinderace non-hollow. Alright, so for this pack we have a Sizzlipede, Snom, Mawile, Gossifleur, a Goldeen, Energy Retrieval, a Ferrothorn, Heatmore, a Reverse Rotom Bike, and a Galarian Obstagoon. Holographic. Very nice. I don't know about you guys, but I actually like this holo pattern a lot. With like the vertical lines and everything. I think it kind of fits this one pretty well. It looks like, oh, like the Aurora Lights. But so we got one holo, so we're one for two. Moving on to the Zamazenta pack. And we got a Goldeen, Diglett, Skoropi, Hootoot, Score Bunny, a Quick Ball, a Mantine, Dottler, a Joltik Reverse, gotta love the pattern again, and we have a Inteleon Holographic. So we got so we got both the Reverse and the regular Holographic. Alright, for this video we're doing much better than the previous Elite Trainer box already. So we got a Silicobra, Minchino, Vulpix, a Mana, Roselia, Rhydon, Eldegoss, Air Balloon, a Reverse Roselia, and a Poltegeist. non hollow rare. We have a Krabby, Cufant, Baltoy, Salandit, My Little Pony, Lumberry, Corvusquire, Galvantula, a Reverse Ferrothorn, and a Stone Journer non hollow Alright, so we have a Joltik, Salandit, Clobopus, Ghastly, Rukuri, Salazzle, Dugtrio, Pokemon Center Lady, a Reverse Sizzlipede, and a Bead Full Art. Very nice. Very nice. I remember when I first played the game, I thought his name was Bede or BD. I don't know. But just, but just hearing um, the official name, I believe it's Bead. And I gotta say, I love the colors on this thing. Like the pink, the purple on his jacket, the green, the yellow, just everything about the card. And let me get my sleeves real quick. Awesome pull. Alright. We have our two final packs right here, both of which are the Snorlax G-Max. Alright, so we have Franklin, Lipbug, Rhyhorn, Clobopus, Goldeen, Palpad, Kingler, Rhydon, a Reverse Raboot, Raboot, pretty sure that's how you say it, Raboot, and a Whimsicott non holo Rare. And on to our last and final pack of this box. Alright, so we have a Pikachu, Sinistee, Wooloo, Shelder, Krogunk, a Corvusquire, Great Ball, Potion, a Reverse Wooloo, and for our final pack, we have a... More Pico V! Very nice. This is like the Pikachu of this generation. But, um, yeah. Such a great way to end this part of the box. And if you guys haven't watched my previous unboxing for the Zacian box, please check it out. But for this one, let me just um, grab the other hollows that I got. Alright, and just to do a quick recap, let me just show you what I got from this box. We have a Inteleon Holographic, a Galarian Obstagoon, a Morpico V, very nice, and we ended off with a Bead Full Art. 
Very nice card, and I'm very happy with this box. This box definitely beat the Zacian box out of the water. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate everyone who watches my videos and takes time to comment, like, and share the video. If you have friends that might be interested in this content, please share with them. And to follow me on other social media, I do have an Instagram with the same handle, retro underscore giraffe. So you can find me there. Um, I'll be keeping you updated with future videos that will be coming up. But as always, um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.